teeth had been forgotten. We obsessed over old grudges, repeating our tragic past. Hatred thrived, growing stronger. the land of Tamaris. You are the warrior spoken of in prophecy. The fate of the realm lies in your hands. May the moon bless all beings. In the beginning, Tamaris was a tranquil paradise. We were blessed with nature's bounty, and in the mist glade, we made our home. As the sons and daughters of Arabon, god of the forest, we were nurtured by the world tree. For generations, we protected nature and lived in peace and harmony. Fire rained from the sky, and the enemy arose from the darkness, as prophecy foretold. An ice-cold shadow is approaching the world tree, and the land is falling into chaos. The forest is beginning to wither. My lord, nature is in peril. Protect it with all your might. 
Greetings, my lord. I am Eredrin, a sage of the forest. The ancient prophecy has come to pass. A dark shadow is trying to taint the world tree's radiance. I will do my utmost to aid you and to defend the forest against its enemies. At the moment, our sight is impaired by a mysterious mist. We must strengthen our homeland before disaster can strike. Building a lumber mill will provide us with the resources we need. We have all the wood we need. Now we must strengthen our wall. The wall protects our city, as strong and unyielding as the most ancient of trees. We are much safer now. We need to train more soldiers. Soon, they will be the arrow with which we pierce the darkness. our bows in service of the forest. Her enemies will pay the price. Now we have a legion. Very good. The god of the forest will soon know of their bravery and determination. My lord, there is an elf seeking our aid outside the city gates. She looks exhausted. We should give her a place to rest. My lord, thank you for your shelter. May the moon shine upon you. I am Gwanwen of Moonvale. While out on patrol, we came under attack from a dragon, and then we were trapped in the mist. It took many days of wandering before I found you. Stars falling from the sky, dragons appearing once more. The ancient prophecy is coming to pass. That's not all. The dragon was accompanied by ferocious beings. They were laying waste to every village in their wake. The prophecy speaks of such creatures, the Darklings. Born from deep within the abyss, they aim to plunge all of Tamaris into darkness. The World Tree's light is already fading. If we cannot stop them, I fear the forest may be lost forever. My lord! Intruders! Outside the city! They're gathered around a bear, performing some sort of ritual! They're the Darklings I encountered earlier. The darkness surrounding that poor creature. I can tell it has something to do with their ritual. We have to stop them. My lord, please, let me lead your legion against them. It's the least I can do to repay you. Before you set out, please, come with me to the altar and take an artifact. Its power will aid you on the road ahead. Could this be of use to our forces? My lord, thank you for your kindness. I will make the Darklings pay for their foul deeds. Quick! The ritual will soon be complete! my bow. No. It's 
can't be! I can sense a powerful force emanating from this stone. Let's bring it back to the city and take a closer look. My lord, the Darklings have been routed. They were using this stone in their ritual. I can sense its power. This is what the Darklings were using to try to control that bear. There is a great darkness within this stone. At the moment, I have no idea of the secrets it could hold. My lord, please. Allow me to take the stone for research. I have a feeling it could be the key to some great mystery. More worrying than the stone is the potential disaster that lurks behind it. Disaster which we cannot foresee. Please, send a scout into the mist. We must learn more. My lord? I have traversed some of the most dangerous places in Tamaris. It would be my honor to explore the mist for you. No trouble at all. Our scout has departed. All that he sees, he will relay to us. For now, let us return to our city and work toward its development. For now, we must continue building our homeland. The darkness is upon us, and we must be strong to resist it. My lord, the sacred hall is the heart of our city. If not with every quest we complete, the World Tree's revival comes closer. One day, life will bloom eternally across the land. Until that day, we cannot cease in our endeavors. My lord, creatures born of shadow are laying waste to our homeland. We must act at once. Deploying legions to defeat gone. Darkling Nature will thrives. grant you hero experience and war spoils. My bow is drawn. Just as it should be.
Some of our units who were wounded in battle have been healed. When our units are wounded in battle, they will receive free healing at our herbalist hut. But this will take time. Don't worry, once our units have healed, they can rejoin our legions. There's a gentle breeze today. guides my arrows. Just aim, draw the string and fire. I am Guanwin of Moonvale. May the moon bless all beings. I could not fully introduce myself before due to the heat of battle. Allow me to present myself, Your Grace. I am a daughter of Clan Golanadel of Moonvale. I served as the captain of our household guard. I served with distinction at the Battle of Pinebark River, so I'm not a complete stranger to real combat. I am a master of the bow and arrow, if I may be so immodest. I would be happy to advise you on all matters of archery. Thank you for your trust. I will take my duties seriously. Please accept these as a sign of goodwill from Moonvale. The upgrade to our Sacred Hall will be complete in five minutes. It might be wise to use a speed-up item to finish it quicker. Construction complete. As you can see, it makes sense to use a speed-up item if you want to build your city faster. My bow is drawn.
Just aim, draw the string, and fire. In a perilous world, we need all the support we can get. You can recruit more heroes at the altar. They're our most important weapon in the fight against the darkness. Who goes there? Greetings, Your Grace. My name is Walder. It shall be my pleasure to serve you. Last we met, urgent matters forbid a formal introduction. I am a Royal Court Mage and a graduate of the College of Tiar. Unlike some of my peers, I have spent most of my career on the battlefield. The battlefield taught me a great many things that the classroom couldn't. I've taken part in a number of military campaigns over the years. Learning how to escape death puts one in good stead when the stakes are high, I've found. I'm very glad to join your forces. I'll do my best. <laughs> my apologies. A habit I picked up on the battlefield, where one must always stay vigilant. I assure you, I am as easy going as they come. Oh, I almost forgot. I bought something for you as a token of our new partnership. Swift as the wind! Hello. Greetings, mortal. I am Aphius. I have been sent from Whitewing Peak to join you. Such is the will of the Oracle. I will obey your commands and protect the destiny of Tamaris. This is the first time we have met. In accordance with your mortal customs, please accept this gift in recognition of this fact. Huh? So, you're the boss? You ain't like I thought you would be. I've seen a couple bosses like you before. They all look 
real fierce, and they never bothered to look you in the eye when they talked to you. But you ain't like that at all, boss. You're pretty friendly. Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. My name's Chakcha. I'm a hunter. I ain't one for brains, but I got strength to make up for it. Anytime you need me, just let me know. Oh, by the way, I brought a couple things from the countryside for you. I hope you like them. My lord, under your leadership, our city has grown like a tree in the spring sunshine. Once the sacred hall has been upgraded, our city will grow to a new size. Congratulations, my lord. Our city has taken a great step forward. The children of the forest are growing in strength. We can now deploy two legions at the same time. By trade, pleased to meet you. I saw an announcement up in Dongrad, and I thought I'd come see you. <laughs> and I brought my business partner, Dronky. The merchants can stop most caravans from going anywhere, so Dongrad's the only place I can do business right now. Well, I've been traveling with us. caravans for years. Know the roads like the back of my hand. Even the places that ain't on the maps. <laughs> no, where's good to set up camp, too. And Dronky's got a good memory. Even when I forget the route, he leads us where we gotta go. Oh, my donkey. <laughs> He's good people. We're here to help. You need anything, 
Just say the word. Oh, yeah, we got you a little something. Thank you for playing Call of Dragons. To help us improve the game in the future, please feel free to leave any comments or suggestions you might have.